Hi, welcome to the Math Magic channel. Today we look at this cool question and how to do it. Let's try it out. So the first thing to think about with this question is, yes, maybe you could cross out x from both sides, in which case you would get 1 is equal to 1 fifth. And that's a bit of a problem. So whenever you do math, try not to eliminate the variable dividing the variable um, because if you do then you might miss out some solutions so sometimes you need to look at questions differently in this case we're going to move the 5 to the left to get 5x is equal to x and then we'll do 5x minus x equals 0 to get 4x equals 0 and when you have a product either the 4 is 0 or the x is 0 and of course 4 cannot be 0 so we say that x is 0 and that is how you do this question without stressing out and without getting rid of the variable so I guess the moral of the story is do not cross out the x's on both sides because then you're left with something nonsensical like 1 equals 1 fifth and that in mathematics is not going to get you very fast. So you need to make sure you keep the variable and you solve for it rather than eliminate it and that's the moral of the story. Thanks for watching today. Make sure to like and subscribe to the Mathematic channel so we can bring you more math videos and we appreciate all your support. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day. See you on the next one. Bye-bye.